Madonna couldn't walk after near-death experience in summer. Following her near-death experience last summer, during which she was hospitalized with a dangerous bacterial infection, Madonna confided in her followers that she couldn't walk. The 65-year-old pop singer had to delay the celebration tour's North American leg due to her emergency room visit in June of last year, which coincided with the 40th anniversary of her musical career. Madonna praised a very special man in the crowd, her doctor David Agus, and added that the sickness was a surprise before beginning the first of five concerts at the Kia Forum in Los Angeles. When I was sick this summer and I literally couldn't walk from my bed to the toilet. I would call him every other day and ask him why I didn't have any energy, when my energy was going to come back, when was I going to feel myself again, when could I go back on tour again. All he would say is, go outside in the sun, you need vitamin D, and your kidneys will keep working, she said. She described the ordeal as a pretty scary, and revealed the first word she said when she woke from her coma. I didn't know for four days because I was in an induced coma, but when I woke up, the first word I said was, no. And I'm pretty sure God was saying to me, you want to come with us? You want to come with me? You want to go this way? And I said, no, no, yes, she said, adding that's what her assistant told her. She described how it was so hard it was to go from her house to the garden so she could enjoy the sun, recalling her challenging recuperation trip. I didn't know when I could get up again and when I could be myself again. It was a strange thing to finally not feel like I was in control. That was my lesson to let go, she added. The Queen of Pop also previously praised her six children for supporting her while she was ill, 